for me, reducing my carbon footprint is just an extension of my responsibility as a human being on this planet. If you think about it, there is literally only one place right now that we can live and you know I have a very vested interest in ensuring that you know this that our whole ecosystem and our planet it just remains healthy. The biggest way that I reduce my carbon footprint when I'm out and about is is just using my bike and um, just as much as is possible walking everywhere or or biking everywhere. Part of it is is with a mind um, to reduce emissions and part of it is uh, financial and part of it is just enjoyment. My top three pieces of kit that I always have when I'm cycling, uh, one, always a helmet. Um, yes, it can make for a little bit of a rough hair day, but um, by far the most important piece of safety equipment. The next thing are my incredibly cool biking goggles. <laughs> uh, for me, um, I, wear, I wear contacts and I just find that um, my eyes get really irritated um, just with the wind or even um, just with some of the debris from the road that can get kicked up. And so uh, for me, goggles are super important. My third thing would definitely be um, I've got my, um, it, it's kind of like a bike rack that hangs off the back of my bike and it just lets me store things if I go grocery shopping or, you know, obviously sometimes I'm carrying, um, you know, my running legs to and from the track. Um, I can just load them on there and um, it just helps take the burden of carrying it. Um, Moving into winter, the most important thing to think about when cycling is safety. And definitely my number one recommendation would be to consider, um, you know, putting the road bike in, in, the, in the garage for a bit and bringing out a hybrid or a mountain bike. I know they're a little bit slower and um, they're going to be tougher to pedal into that wind, but I just like to think of it in terms of, you know what, it's winter, you can just get away with that extra eggnog or extra hot chocolate. <laughs>